Welcome to Build Your First Node.js Website, Part 2. I'm Ruth Willenborg, a Distinguished Engineer at IBM. In Part 2, you'll be adding the Express Framework to your Node.js application. and This is going to allow you to actually format out HTML pages and add links. And once again, we'll be doing the entire exercise using IBM Bluemix and DevOps services, so you will not have to install anything locally. In part two, you'll once again be bringing up a Node.js server, but this time we have the Express Framework set up so that the uh, app.get is going to accept the requests from the browser, and we're actually going to be rendering a page index.ejs to display the HTML homepage. So you'll see this when you get into the code. Uh, so this time you're going to be making requests to your URL, um, but what you're going to be able to get back is a formatted HTML page. And you'll be working with this HTML page and adding links in this project. In this project, we're again going to be working in DevOps Services, the integrated development environment. This time when I explore, I want, for Ari Willen, I want to choose the Node.js Simple 2 project. And once again, I will hit the Fork Project button and start a new project that I can edit. Once it's created the new project, I just go into Edit Code, and that allows me to start editing. The code this time is set up a little bit differently because we've gone ahead and put in for you the dependencies on Express so that that's all in there correctly. And then we this time have a views folder also with a starting index HTML page. So the first thing that the step-by-step um, -step instructions are going to have you do is just go in and make some static uh, changes to this HTML page and then to go ahead and deploy those changes. I deploy the exact same way I did in the first project, I would just put the name of the host that I want to use and hit deploy. And just like I did in the first project, I just follow the link where I go to my new website. And when that website comes up this time, you see it's a little different now. It's a formatted page with my change. And again, we have a working counter. So from here, you can follow the step-by-step -step directions and make additional changes to your website. You'll be adding your own counter, and you'll also be adding links and things to your web pages. Okay, now it's your turn to give it a try. You can go to IBM Bluemix and sign up for your free trial. The link is here to my article that has the step-by-step -step directions. There are also printable uh, sushi cards, uh, one page at a time, and we've designed these to make it easy enough for kids, so I know you guys can all do this. Uh, and I also have an activity kit now that's uh, built out as a one-hour learning module around this um, project. So everybody, time to get hands-on and start building your first Node.js website. I hope you enjoy it, and I look forward to hearing your feedback and how we can improve things.